what's going on youtube land as you can see i have a change of scenery honey i am in miss houston texas and i said i promised i was going to give y'all a video every wednesday and every friday and so i am here to do so ah let me get adjusted and let me get comfortable <laughs> so this story um is about friends and it's just about my reason my reasons of not letting new people or or being very very cautious of who you let in your your circle okay regardless of who they are how much money they make um uh, etc etc so um i met this chick we just gonna call this chick tamika and um i met this chick years ago at a fundraiser that i had in my store where i was um auctioning off a dress to give to a needy family for christmas and tamika and another chick we gonna call her this other chick was bidding on the dress and so i think the dress went for like four hundred dollars the the family was able to have a merry merry christmas thanks to the house of Chappelle. and i did not do it by myself people donated money they donated uh pre gifts um and clothing and um christmas trees and all that stuff for this family um and i think that's something that i actually want to do this year um and um uh, so they both met up at the store at the same time tamika and this other chick and um they met each other we all became good friends i rarely talked to the other chick but since then the other chick has got married has had a baby moved to new york with a husband um uh, but tamika is still in atlanta i'm um, very very successful beautiful woman um and i just don't need to feel the need why this chick just well we're gonna get into that later so um uh, um, she had a she had a boyfriend. Uh, she lived with a boyfriend, um, and I had my boyfriend uh, from DC, Mike, at the time. And um, you know, we um, and then me and Mike broke up, uh, and a couple of years later, I was dating Tigger. So this is let, to let you know the 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 length of time we've been knowing each other. As far as it's been it's been about five, six, seven years. Um, and when I needed anything, she was there when I needed a shoulder to cry on. She was a doctor when I needed to, you know, get checked out on anything. She was like, Rico, you come to me. We don't do our friends like that, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, this lady let me borrow some coins, um, have let me borrow coins, um, always patronized me, buying my clothes. So the um, boyfriend called me one day. And was just like, I got a surprise for Tamika and I want you there. So I'm like, oh shit, he gonna finally ask to marry her. <laughs> and um, so I was like, cool, I'm there. Just let me know what I need to do. Yada, yada, yada. You got to promise not to tell her. I'm like, cool. So in my head and the rest of, even in the other chick's head and my and my mother's head, because we, my mother met them because we always we used to go over each other's house and eat. Either my mom would cook, either they would cook or have barbecue. We would go to my best friend's house. We would always have like some type of Sunday thing going on. That's what we did in Atlanta. And um, and so we showed up to this brunch. Um, I was next to the other chick. And we was just talking about, is he going to engage? Because she was getting her PhD. Um, and um, he was just, the lunch was gorgeous. Absolutely amazing. We was kicking like we normally do. We got up and said some words to Tamika about congratulations of getting her PhD. Um, and that was pretty much it. So he said, come on outside. And we was like, oh shit, we finna get a ring. We finna get a ring. Cause like, I'm like, oh, I'm dying to plan a friend's wedding and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So child, we get outside, honey. He drove around, he rides around the corner and a big old, Range Rover, brand new Range Rover. We was like, <laughs> even the mama, the family was like, okay, girl, <laughs> what a ring at? We was like, okay, what a ring at? And he was like, congratulations. And we was like, is that all? <laughs> no, I guess that's it. And so I turned to the mama, I said, girl, I just knew we was gonna have a ring. He said, child, she said, child, me too. And um, no, it was the grandmama. I turned to the grandmama. And um, and so uh, and that was kind of it. And my best friend was like, "What?" My best friend is very, Damien is very boisterous. He's like, "Well, what the fuck? What happened to the ring?" So okay, time goes on or whatever. Um, she said, "Rico, he just asked to marry me." We went to Tahiti, um, and he, Anthony Hamilton, Hamilton was there. Um, he invited, he flew some of my family out, and he proposed to me. With Anthony Hamilton, Hamilton singing. I was like, okay, well, girl, that's what's up, girl, what's up? We're time to get this wedding crack. 
drinking. So at the time, planning her wedding, I had just got the job for Candy Wedding. I had broke up with Tigger. It was a mess, child. Um, and it was, I was just kind of busy into work. And she said, well, Rico, I know you're busy into work, so I'm not going to ask you to make my wedding gown. My mom is buying me this Vera Wayne Girl, I was like, you know what? I, hey, I can't even hate on that. Go ahead and get that Vera Wayne gown. I'm working over here. She said, well, if you have time, I know you got this press uh, stuff to do with Merit and Medicine um, and Candy. So let me know if you have time. I was like, okay. And she knew my schedule because we've always was communicating. She knew Mariah, this is that and the third. So we would always communicated what I had to do. And I just had really, really got from like, boom, boom, real busy, real quick. So um, I'm like, okay, the wedding is near. It's going to be in August. Um, so my best friend was going to come down because he had moved to New York. And so I'm like, okay, well, what's up? I'm calling her. I didn't hear from her and I got kind of worried. So I was like, I got wrapped up in my, my work and didn't hear from her until like a month or two later. And I was like, girl, congratulations, girl. She was like, I didn't get married. I was like, oh, shit, what happened, girl? What happened? And um, she was just like, well... My grandmother died. I was like, oh my God, are you serious? And she said, we had to postpone everything. I was like, well, what about all your money? All your money, you spend all these deposits, da 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 da. Um, and um, she was just like, they allowed me to move it back to May on a Sunday. I really didn't want Sunday, but I mean, that's the only day that they had available for this venue. And I'm like, okay, now let, let's go back. During the planning of the wedding, she was going to, she was having Preston Bailey, the, the, huge celebrity wedding planner out of New York. She was going to have um, uh, the Vera Wayne dresses and she was going to have the, the Vera Wayne dress and she was going to have the um, the wedding at the same mansion that they shot Hunger Games in. I was like, girl, what girl? What are you trying to spin, girl? What's the tea? What, what? <laughs> so I was like, okay. So a couple of months before May hit, a couple of uh, years ago, um, we was going over everything. So my thing in my head, you already kind of planned the wedding. You got all the, the, the stuff that you need. So it was really kind of no need for me or whatever. And so she was just like, I had to go fit for my dress. And I'm like, fit for my dress? And we already had discussed the Vera Wayne dress again. And I saw the sketch. And I was like, that ain't no Vera Wayne dress. I, the dress was absolutely gorgeous. But that ain't no Vera Wayne dress. I'm said to my head, I was like, okay, well... We just gonna keep this on the wraps, girl. If you say the if you say the the, the sky is teal on your for your wedding, I'ma believe you, girl, because you my friend. I'm gonna support you, even though you sound a little cray cray. And so, um, you know, she was just like, I need to, Rico. Um, you have any gowns for my engagement photos? I was like, Yeah, I just had a photo shoot and for. I mean, I just had did New York Fashion Week. So yeah, I got a whole bunch of gowns. Gave